Don't I'm give me that just do it. Stuff. Your Frozen hole. carrots. Thank you very much for the subscription. That sounds like a nice, healthy summer snack, as long as you don't break your teeth. What's up, dog? Hey there. Oh, okay. Good enough, I guess. Man of few words. Are you gonna holster your weapon at Gamora? I'd forgotten about that. I guess I'll consider it, if it uh, seems prudent at the time. Go to that big tower. I don't know if I'm ready, man. I'm scared of heights. It seems like a reasonable fear, to be honest with you. You know, mankind uh, back in the in our evolutionary history, we didn't get 35,000 feet up in the air too often. Well, it's a, quite a nice gated community. I hope they let me in here. If you jump on the flaming barrel, do you become fire? 10 experience. Free sides, east gate. Let's enter. Oh, okay. It's not really much of a gated community. If I can just open it up, but that's okay. Gotta do what you gotta do. This town actually looks pretty nice. It also runs a lot more smoothly, weirdly enough. Looking for a fix, man? I got what you need. You need to get some sleep. Have a look, baby. So this guy, it's, he's got drugs. Would you perhaps be interested in purchasing some sensor modules? Why, yes. Yes, he would be. Fantastic. A pleasure doing a, a drug deal with you, my friend. Else. You are not going to be in business much longer. Step away from the girl. Boone, this isn't about you, man. Local. Sounds suspicious. Put the gun away! Put the gun away! There we go. You hear about that band of crazy old ladies running around? I hear they're real vicious when they mug folks. Sure. Um, yeah, let's go to Mick and Ralph's. Is this like a, a rug store? Perhaps it could be like some kind of rug store? If you're looking for guns, talk to Mick. Otherwise, I've got a nice selection of general supply. Honestly, I don't think I need anything else here, so... I only offer services if the king gives the okay. Impress him, and we can talk. Wouldn't it be awesome if the king was actually, uh, literally Elvis Presley? We got 50 speech, we might as well try it. A resourceful fellow such as yourself must have something on the side. Alright. Yeah, I've got a little side business going. But what I'm about to share with you does not leave this room, eh? Over the years, I've gradually perfected my craft to the point of perfection. No one can distinguish between my work and the real thing. What I'm referring to is passports. If you've got the caps, I can whip up a strip passport which will fool even the most well-trained eye. Hey, if you're interested and have the caps, they go for 500. Any less and it ain't worth the risk of getting caught. What do you say? You game? I have 500 caps. Um... Can't barter yet. I'll tell you, I'll just pay it. Here you go. What do you want to know? Oh! That's my, uh, antivirus software. Go away! I don't want to restart my computer now. And my mouse pointer is gone. Previously, it was actually sort of working. No, my mouse pointer is straight up dead. Okay, that's fine. Let me get the Twitch chat back up here. And then tab back into New Vegas. All right. Waste of 500 caps. What do I... I don't need money, man. If you haven't heard of the king... He must have been living under a rock or something. The king has his boys all over Freeside. He controls the water pump and is essentially the go-to guy for what goes around here. Okay. They are the local energy weapon dealers in Freeside. When it comes to lasers and plasma, they're the only game in town, and they keep it that way. Gloria's men are the best armed in Freeside and ruthless to boot. But her brother, Jean-Baptiste Cutting, puts them all to shame. It's a great name. Their joint is the only place in Freeside to get it all under one roof. They've got gambling, booze, chems, and whores. They're good folks, just don't cross them. They're known for tidying up loose ends with a bullet to the brain box. 
Bullet to the brain box. All right, you know what? Goodbye. I'm gonna talk to Mr. Guns over wherever he is. Nice terminal, man. That's working pretty good. Mr. Guns? Welcome to Mick and Ralph's. If you need guns, I'm your man. This is how you operate a business? And other services. See my partner, Ralph. Okay, um... How's business? Things were better when the Omertas were buying, but we did buy. Good selection from traders, and the Van Graffs keep things running. That's the thing. I have no idea. They just stopped buying guns all of a sudden. If you hear anything, let me know. Alright, will do. Anything else I can help you with? Um, I really can't buy anything because I just bought a counterfeit passport from your friend. Uh, or, you know, lover. I don't know how you operate your business here. That's okay. It is 5.25 p.m. I am going to be a little overly cautious. I can't, I can't sleep in an owned bed? And I'm actually just going to sleep for like 13 hours so that it's going to be still night outside. Or still, sorry, it's going to be still day outside. It's going to take a little while here, but that's okay. NL get a new gun? I got a gun and it's called Boone and it never breaks. And he's the world's greatest man and I love him. Good day. You would get I've been here for 13 hours, man. Do you, do you have a family? Go home and get some sleep. Wow, what the heck? Boone! He's coming right for me, man. Oh, you are in for a bad time. Easy peep. Big misses. Big misses. Oh, big hits. Big hits. What the heck? That guy was extremely rude. Ill-mannered. And now you just killed that man. What are you talking about? He came at me with a freaking machete. Why does nobody else get attacked by these machete-wielding maniacs? Mick and Ralph's for all your shopping needs. Hello. Stop by Mick and Ralph's for all your shopping needs, sir. Mick and Ralph's is. I'm aware of where Mick and Ralph's is. I thought maybe you might have some information for me. Come to Mick and Ralph's for all your shopping. He just wanted to give you a haircut. He had a wife and kids. Yo, you should have thought of that before he came after me, man. The Kings. Okay. Perhaps it is Elvis Presley. Squatters aren't happy about the water rationing. But then when are they ever happy? I'm not gonna murder the child, chat. School of impersonation. Can't wait to hit the Wrangler tonight. Just me and my favorite girl. I didn't ask for your life story, man. What am I even let me set the stage here. Data, quests. Ring a ding ding, confront Benty, uh, Benny at the Tops Casino. Man, I'm hungry. I'd give you want some uh, Dandy Boy apples? Welcome to the strip. Is this the Tops Casino? This guy looks semi familiar. New to Freeside, so here's a little advice, friend. Don't go past the Southgate greeter without talking to it first. This guy's got one hell of a chin. It's a flavor saver. Those bots are programmed to vaporize anyone who enters the fenced-in area without authorization from the greeter. The name's Old Ben. I've been living in Freeside since the day I was born. This guy sounds so much like Bear to me. The name's Old Ben. I've done a bit of everything around here. Courier, butcher, crier, escort, gun for hire. Some of which I'm not proud of, but I do my best to help around town when needed. Uh, I used to be a courier. Exactly one of the reasons I got out of that job. Too many shifty characters looking to have someone else move their hot items. Okay, um, you said escort like armed guard. Well, I suppose you could look at it that way, but I was packing a whole different kind of heat. No, 
Escort just sounds better than man whore. Yep. I was damn good at my job, too. But after a while, I just felt like a piece of meat and had to quit. He does kind of look like Bear. I mean, there's some obvious discrepancies. For example, this guy is old, Bear is not. However, he has a bearish face, absolutely. Um, let's find out something else. Goodbye. Chat is advising me not to rush this quest. So I will not rush this quest, and we'll go back and talk to the king instead. Mercy fuck him. This doesn't even make any sense. At least we learned some information. I thought I could jump in through this window. I wouldn't recommend it. Might get a little cut up. But, um... Yeah, we learned not to go past the south gate without the greeter. Door to the King's School of Impersonation. And is this... That's not the King. That's the King's gang member. Hi. Hello. Pacer. What do we have here? Another petitioner for the King? <laughs> It is a school of impersonation. They're not professionals yet. Anything's possible, I suppose. How much is it worth to you to meet the big man? Um, yeah, speech 60. I'm new in town and wanted to pay my respects. You know what? I like you. Half the people around here, they forget who runs this place. Half of the people around here forget who runs this place. King is the bored-looking guy by the stage. Can't fucking miss him. It's a magical door. Board look. This is a, a dog with an exposed brain. I like this. King, sir, I demand an audience. Excuse me. I don't speak to you unless I'm standing on the table. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Look, Rexy, someone new's come to see us. Poor boy. I'm gonna rip your in out through your bunghole. Forgetful I'm Dave the Gamer, thanks for the subscription. For Much appreciated. Alright, uh, I was hoping you might have some work for me. Maybe so. Maybe so. You look like you might be able to handle yourself. Tell you what, you do me a favor, and I'll have some more work for you when it's done. Sound good? I'll start you off with something easy. Did you notice the bodyguards for hire near the gates when you entered Freeside? Uh, no, actually, I did not. It's good money if you can stay alive long enough. Freeside's not as safe as it used to be, so the money is well earned. <laughs> Usually a little bit more Bill Clinton y, I agree. Recently, my man told me that one of his bodyguards, a fellow named Oris, is making a little too much money. He's making a killing in repeat business. Once someone hires him, they never want anyone else. I want you to find out why. Specifically, I want you to hire him. Play the part of an innocent tourist and follow his lead. If nothing happens, so be it. But I'm guessing things won't go so smoothly. Call it a hunch. So, what do you say? Um, sure, yeah, I'll, no questions asked. Okay then, once you part ways, return here. I'll look forward to hearing your report. Oh, and take this to cover the hiring cost. My eyes on the street tell me you haven't paid our mutual friend All right, for let's us, go find this guy. Is this, uh, does it automatically become our number one quest? No. GI Blues. Dude, let's do this. I'm not gonna just take his caps and run. 200 is not worth it. We're gonna be, uh... Well, it's not worth it in my opinion. We're gonna be, uh... Smart. We're gonna try to get in good with the king for now. Why did you have to talk to the king with his face at dong height NL? Because 90% uh, of communication is nonverbal, so when I'm standing like on top of the table, he knows that it means I'm above him. You're not doing yourself a favor by having him tag along. NCR aren't welcome here. You alright, man? I'm in the corner, watching you kiss her. I wish he could keep doing that, because I... That Robin joke was going to go substantially further, but okay, that's fine. Oh, sorry. Make sure there's no trains coming. Even Boone was pretty smart there. Is this you? This is you. If you need to cross Freeside, no one will keep you safer than I will. Um, why do I need a bodyguard? Just look around. People here are as like to stab you as say hello. That is, if I weren't at your side. 
200 caps gets you my watchful eye for a trip to the south gate. This guy sounds super familiar. Is it like three dudes doing the voices here over and over? Okay, I'm gonna hire you. Done and done. I want to mention a few things up front. In order to ensure your safety, I need you to follow my instructions to the letter. We'll be I'm gonna down rip the your innards out through your bunghole! Don't blow my no cover, details. Joe Ed 112784. Thank you for the subscription. I'll keep a brisk pace, so try not to fall behind. Now let's head out. Let's do it! Yo, dude, I don't have sprints. Okay, follow Oris to the south gate and watch for any suspicious behavior. You know, like that? Here is the old Mormon fort. You get roughed up, the followers there will patch you right up. Not that I ever need their services. Up ahead on the next block is where the kings hang out. Don't let them scare you. If it can they be bought, it can Shut up! I'm listening to the quest giver. Keep up that brisk pace, NL. Down to the right here is the fun It's a nice jog. You haven't seen Freeside till you've been to the Wrangler. Where's the Wrangler? Wrangler? Wrangle? Probably that way, I guess. Hey, <laughs> slow down. You told me to keep a brisk like pace! Some of those men ahead. Let's take a different way around. Alright, yeah, that looks a little a little sketchy. Oh, you're leading the way, Oris. You just don't worry about what I'm facing. Anything going on uh, down here? No, I was kind of hoping we could may maybe get in, uh, some combat with them. That's okay. I don't need experience anyway. <laughs> oh my god, he's so... Oh! Jesus! Alright, this guy, he's worth the 200 caps, man. If you had hired one of those other hacks, you'd be up to your ass in low life right about now. Hey, you only fired three shots and there were four guys here. Uh, noticed that, did you? I keenly aimed one of the shots through some soft tissue of one of them to hit the man behind him. Mmm, something sneaky here. That's an interesting theory you've got there. I'd suggest you keep it to yourself. Oh, this Let's guy is not all that he seems. Okay. Stay close. I wouldn't want anything to happen to you. Oh, this guy's gonna turn on me. Do I have 30 minutes in one sec? You hold up a second, Oris. I'm gonna try to reanimate these corpses. Skills. Medicine. 35. Examine the body closely. The thug is still alive and merely pretending to be dead. Oh. Okay, that's it. Oris isn't coming. Right. Who was that talking? Or yeah, I shot him in the head. Oris isn't paying us paying us enough to put up with this shit. Let's just kill this one and be done with it. Oris. Oh god! Like that? Boone, you alright, buddy? Yo, Boone is getting roughed up a little bit. Boone! I think he might have had enough, honestly. There you go. Well done, Boone. You did it. This is how it ends. This is how it ends? No, don't let this freaking lady claw you to death, man. Boone. Oh, there we go. Okay. He's, I was a little scared there for a minute. Alright, that was uh, easy. Definitely want that. Definitely want that. Definitely want that. that, that. Alright. Oh, that was so scary, man. I'm glad he... If he died, I'm glad he almost died Fine in his beret, me. though. Okay, so I'm gonna give him Oris' sweet armor. And maybe I'll give him the. Might as well give him like one of these guns. Maybe he can use something better than I'm using right now. Why don't you take the damage 4.5 times 14? I missed the DPS there. Just take the yeah, take the sod off, man. Go nuts. 
Oh, he's the world's greatest badass now. All right, let's return to the king. He's like one of the Legion of Doom members. The guy who decapitated is faking it. I'm not going to give him some grenades. He's going to explode, isn't he? Boone's a sniper. Yo, he... That's all right. He can take the weapon. He can hold it, at least. Doesn't he need bullets? He can find his own freaking bullets, as far as I'm concerned. Ooh, what a rush. Oh, what a rush. It's like late October 2081. I like this dog. I gotta be honest. What do you have for me? Ah, so it went down like that, huh? I guess it can't be helped now. Well, you're not subtle, but you get the job done. That's good enough for me. Maybe you can help me with something more important. A lot of folks around these parts who've been here a while resent the sheer number of people that have come into the area since the strip was built. In turn, the newcomers, most of whom come from the NCR, have gotten ornery from being resented. Sometimes things get violent. This is one of those occasions. Recently, a few friends of mine were attacked, and I want you to find out who did it. Words come that they just woke up over at the old Mormon fort just north of here. Head on over, see if they remember anything. Good. I like that enthusiasm. Return when you have some information we can use. Don't look at me like that, Rex. This is the cutest dog, man! Anyway, um... Let's get going here. Thank God Oris gave me a tour before I murdered him. What's up? What's up? You eyeballing me? We should probably heal a little bit here. Um... Let's just eat some food? That might be enough to get us decently high up on that. It's starting to climb. We'll see. Careful around that hostile brain butt. Brain bot. Oh, brain bot. Okay, the Mormon fort's back here. Just north of here, he said. So back this way. What's up? Tomo pooped outside of the litter box. Is it bad? It's okay? It's already okay. That's not a surprise to me that Tomo pooped outside of the litter box. He's got a... He's, uh, he's got a habit of doing so. Sometimes he does so. Um, okay, I'm gonna eat some more, I think, because we have not finished our... healing, so we'll drink some Sunset Sarsaparilla. We even get a bottle cap back for that. Tomo always poops outside of the litter box, man. It's his thing. Uh, we're gonna have to come around this way, I think. I'm not gonna mercy kill Tomo. He's the world's greatest cat, except for the whole pooping thing. But even then, you take the good with the bad, you know? Hello. Is he, he's like cheerfully gonna cut up that poor animal? Our health's okay. Got a heck of a loading screen this time. I gotta close my door. I can actually sort of smell that, Tomo. That's okay, buddy. It happens. Who do we have to talk to? This tent? This tent. What is it? Can't you see I want to be left alone with my friend here? Why is your head so smooth but your face is so wrinkly? Oh, that's different then. How can I help? I'll do anything to get the bastards that did this. Maybe you can start by having a little bit of common effing decency. Well, it happened at night, around 11. We'd recently made some caps off a bit of scrap we found and wanted to invest it wisely. As we were leaving the Wrangler, we must have taken a wrong turn and ended up in the squatter side of town. From out of nowhere, these big guys show up and start barking questions at us, wanting to know if we were locals. The kid there is about as proud as a local around here gets, and started yelling back at him. Then all hell broke loose. Kid got the worst of it, sad to say. Alright. Chat, you were right, he's a bald bro. If he wants to join me, he's welcome. They were big guys. Young, too. No old geezers like me. Hell, none of them looked even half my age. I was mostly face down in the dirt, begging for my life when it happened, so I only got a quick look at them. I hope you find the bastards that did this. If you want, try asking my friend Wayne over there about them. He saw more than I did. 
All right. Is this Wayne? Wayne, it's okay. The king sent him. That true? Did the king really send you? Of course. I don't really know what else I can add. They were a bunch of guys, better dressed than most freesiders, I guess. That help? Oh, you know what? I think we're talking about Benny here, man. Sorry I couldn't help more, especially since you're being so nice. Oh, I don't trust hey, this wait, guy at all. I just remembered something. I might have heard one of the guys that attacked us call another by name. We had just about had it when one of them said, Hey, Lou, we gotta go. At least I think he said Lou. It might have been something else. He actually said, yeah, Hey, I, I gotta go he poo. He Lou but... something. Something with a T. Tenant. That's what he called him. Lou Tenant. Oh, my. He probably said Lieutenant Wayne. The boy means well, but he's dumb as a mutant sometimes. Hope what I remembered helps. Lieutenant? Oh, yes, I remember Lieutenant. I just got back from his dinner party. Uh, it was hosted by his wife, Jen Earl. Hello. There she is right there. That's Boone. Hello there. Hello. You all right? You all right, buddy? All right, he's got nothing good. Hey. What? Tell the king we thank him. All right, we got to go back to the us. king. Um, well, I don't, I don't mean we don't have to. Wish the followers would get me some better armor. I can give you some better armor, lady. It's so freaking heavy. I don't even want it anymore. Boone is now Jen Earl. Yep. He asked for it, and he shall receive. You just go faster if you run. Yo, if you don't get off this freaking street corner, there's not going to be a street corner for you to get off soon. Mercy kill the patients? Oh, they haven't done anything to deserve that. Open enrollment. Personal space meaning anything to you, guy? Hey, does this mean anything to you, guy? Look, I know Lieutenant. You don't want to fuck with me. That was a heck of a fetch quest there. Oh, there's another dude here. It's Pacer. Have you found anything out? Or were you just here to chat? Yo, you don't do anything. How do you run this town? You just sit here and watch this freaking Elvis impersonator all day. Bunch of soldier boys, huh? They usually don't come around these parts since their big base is on the other side of the strip. If they're coming over here now, it's got to be for a reason. I didn't want to believe the rumors that they're looking to take over Vegas. But now, if something big is going down, I'm sure rumors of it will have spread. Ask around, particularly in the squatter areas where the NCR folk hang. You might also mosey on over to the Mormon fort and chat Julie Farkas up. The followers tend to be in the Sorry, middle of what's her name? Things. Just don't ask her what to do about it. She'll probably ask you to hug someone or something. Julie Farkas. Julie Farkas. Well, we might as well. I think it's on the way. That's, you guys ever play Freddy Farkas Frontier Pharmacists? The old, like, Sierra adventure game on PC? Farkas, Freddy Farkas, four-year college degree. It's, it's got a great uh, opening jingle. All right, I'm going to go talk to Julie Farkas because she's, like, right here. Hell, Julie Farkas. That was a office space joke that didn't really work. That is not a real game, you just imagined it. That is not true. Hey. Freddy Farkas Frontier Pharmacist is 100% real. Julie Farkas? Julie Farkas? Beatrix Russell? You oh! Howdy. I've been around a while. Currently working for the followers as a gun for hire. But it's getting rather dull. Aside from protecting them from the occasional thug looking to intercept supply shipments, there isn't much to do around here. The one researcher I liked, who I could chat up about liquor, got transferred. And the rest of the docs are pretty uptight about my kind of fun. Are you okay? Where's Julie Farkas? Uh, I bet you've seen a lot over the years. I've been around long enough to observe the patterns of human behavior. Physical and mental anguish are especially exciting to explore. Sounds like you're a bit of a dom, Beatrix. Hey, who doesn't enjoy a little pinch and squeal every once in a while? I'm not comfortable with the way this is going. I joined up looking for a decent paying job. Granted, the pay's all right, but they won't let me kick back and slog a brew at the end of the day. 
They're worried the filthy drunkies in detox seeing me drink will cause an immediate relapse. And I'll set her up with Chris Haverson? This looks like his kind of girl, man. Revolving door. All right, let's talk about something else. What do you Don't talk to me. The only thing I know for certain is that I don't know nothing. That's actually like a pretty responsible way to share advice. Uh, okay. I'm out. Thank you, Beatrix, though. You seem very personable. I'm not encroaching on your territory, dog. Have at it. Hello. Sure. Oh, they will let me sleep here. That's nice. Luck's about to change. I can feel it. You see where you are, right, man? Like, did you see that zombie? Are you here to drop off medical supplies? Leave them with the rest in the middle of the courtyard. You know what? As far as I'm concerned, she's cool with me. She can be in the bald bros as well. She's got like less than 50% coverage. Um, do you know anything about the NCR soldiers here in Freeside? Only a little. A friend of mine, Major Elizabeth Kieran, has been handing out supplies to the poor a little west of here. What about it? Um, the King thinks these troops have been attacking the locals. I know something's got them riled up, but I've been too busy with other matters to really look into it. If you're looking into the matter, talk to Elizabeth. She's in charge of the operations here in Freeside. Though, she won't open up to you right away. Uh, she hasn't if seen Elizabeth my speech, Dad. <laughs> tell her that I sent you. She should be a little more forthcoming if you mention my name. Was there anything else you wanted to talk about? I was uh, interested in asking you uh, what kind of hand exercises you do to get a hand that is, like, the size of your face. Just checking. Well, goodbye. Dot, dot, dot. Look at these freaking nutcrackers here. Oh, my God. All right. Um... Phase two, the other optional quest.